what's going on guys so you can tell from the title we got a big video to talk about right here so uh we're almost done with invention invention is going to be released this friday on the 10th the exact time i can't say for sure i'm aiming around 1 p.m pacific standard time which is the server's time you know what i think that this time like on the the dev world is just my time but i think on the actual server it's not so i think that that's why i got so confused i'll figure out what time it would be in game and i'll let you guys know um so yeah, we got that coming out soon, and we've been working a lot on that. And since we've been working on that, we've been working on that for so long that the server has sort of lost some momentum. It's sort of, you know, the player count has been, you know, slowing down. And um, we've had a lot of people leave just because there hasn't been that many updates. Um, you know, I, there's one thing I learned from doing Invention. It's that you kind of have to have consistent updates. You just, you can't take this long to do any updates. So if we ever do something like this in the future, we have to either do it quicker, do it smaller, and release it in different batches. I don't know, but the server can't go this long without consistent updates. I think that's the main thing that really keeps people interested. Private servers are sort of designed to be faster. You know, they're, everything you... Everything you do is generally faster than it would be on old school. That's the whole point. So you progress through content pretty quickly. And um, a lot of the content I've created is you, you can you can basically play through the content faster than I can create it. So we've got to do better ways of making things harder, but at the same time, you know, more rewarding or, or more enjoyable. That way, it's to, you know, you can try to justify it. So uh, if you have any ideas, any thoughts on that, you can comment below. We do have a new survey. Um, we are going to be giving away... Uh, some prizes because I really want you to participate in the survey so if you don't participate in the surveys before please participate in this one uh, top prize uh, we'll actually do three winners first place will win a hundred dollar bond second place will win fifty dollar bond and third place will win a twenty five dollar bond so if you're interested in that uh, please go to the uh, description and fill out the poll so I'll talk about that right now it is pretty much just a feedback poll that is the wrong one is that one showing anything nah you're fine uh, so gambling, yeah, that's uh, it's in the title. We're 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 starting to consider it. Uh, the reason we never wanted gambling was because most people didn't like gambling. Most people, in, in terms of staff team and whatnot, and myself, John, none of us really wanted gambling. But we're starting to realize that it's going to be very difficult to maintain our player base without it. Uh, so we, you know, average around eighty players or so. Sometimes higher, sometimes a little bit lower, and. Um, I don't think we can maintain that. I, I don't know if we can maintain it with gambling, but I know we can't maintain it without. That's why we're trying to explore new things and, you know, try to appeal to different people. Every server out there, or at least most of them, have gambling, and that's kind of what people expect. And there's a lot of people who play specifically for that reason, so uh, we've decided to consider it. Now, don't panic. It's not, ha you know, coming out right now. It's going to be done uh, properly. Whatever we do, whenever, however we do it, we're going to do it good. Uh, so if you have any feedback on, if you're like a pro gambler, you know, let us know your thoughts. Um, if you're against gambling, you don't have to give me your thoughts. I know that most people are against gambling. Um, it's one of those things where we want to try to make sure that people who don't want it aren't affected by it and people who do want it can play it, you know. So it's one of those things where uh, we're going to we're gonna do a lot, of, a lot of things, try to make it the way we want it. And we're going to release all this information to you as the time comes. Um, so when I'm making this video and uploading it, it's the 7th of November. We're not... We're in like in the very early stages of, of developing this. You know, we're we're mostly coming up with ideas on everything we want to do, and then we'll work on coding it, and then we'll you know test it in game and whatnot. So you don't have to worry. We're gonna do it correctly, and everything we do along the way, you'll be a part of. Uh, so next question is just how do you feel about the staff team? There's been a lot of discussions about the staff team lately, and I just kind of want to get your feedback. Good, negative. If you want to single anybody out, this is completely anonymous. This survey only I have access to it. I might show Matt the results, but if you want anything, you know, to be anonymous, it's going to be. So you don't have to worry about that. Say your true feelings. If you have complaints about Matt or complaints about myself, you know, let me know as well. I mean, obviously, if you have complaints about me, I'm going to know about it, but feel free to do so. I'll, I'll, work, my, I'll, work, I'll work my hardest to, to, to resolve any of your problems. So uh, after Invention, we are going to start going back to the two updates a month system if we can uh, I like to do two good updates a month at least like every every week or two there needs to be a good update coming out and obviously we did we did littler updates along the ways you know minor bug fixes here and there small like quality of life things people wanted I'm mostly just talking about big content so these are the uh, big things we've got sort of planned for the next couple of months 
Um, just let me know what you're most excited for. Maybe if, if everyone likes the same thing, maybe we'll put that higher on the list. I've told people on my calendar that, like, in my count the calendar in my head that Comp Cape will be coming next. So that's what's currently planned. But if you have a different opinion, you want something else to be done, let us know. Uh, which of these do you value most? This is just trying to see where we should spend most of our focus. What is the majority of the community care about what is the thing that they, they sh you know are focusing on so uh the next one is do you like the content we've created thus far if you like where we're going you know yes if you if you think things should be changed no and if you have any other feedback you know you can do that as well um so if you've recently joined the server we just want to know how you feel about the server how you're liking it if you have any thoughts do you think it's too hard too easy uh do you think the information is available one thing i've noticed about um, I don't know if it's necessarily a problem with, with my server. I think it might just be a problem in general that a lot of other people experience. Um, we're having a hard time getting information out there because not everyone watches my videos. Not everyone reads the forums. Not everyone's in Discord. It's really hard to like figure out how to give the information out there for everyone. So newer players who have just joined the server might not know about my YouTube channel. Maybe they found they came from a different YouTube channel. They came from a voting website. So they're not going to have access to this information. Obviously, telling you that in my video isn't going to help. They're not going to be able to find this anyways. But if you recently joined, just let me know your feedback. And then the same for if you recently quit. If you recently quit the server, let us know why. If there's any specific reason, if there's anything we can improve on. If you have any feedback, let us know. Um, next up is, did you enjoy the Halloween event? Got a couple options here, though. Pretty simple. Um, if you have any feedback on the Halloween event, it, it, to me, it felt like not that many people cared about the Halloween event. Um, we've done two events since the server's been up. Server came up in June and really kind of got popular in September. So we didn't really have that many holidays. So we did a player appreciation event. That was the first event we ever did. And that went really well. Um, it seemed like everyone liked that. Everyone was always at the event. There was tons of people there. It was a pretty popular event, in my opinion. And this one, um, I thought was going to be really hype because of the boss that gives everyone a loot. I thought that that would be really awesome. People seemed to like that idea. And it just kind of, no one did it. No one ever did the event. So if you have any feedback on that, let me know. We would like to add a Hall um, not Halloween, a Thanksgiving event and a Christmas event. We like to do, we like to do all the holidays and whatnot. Um, so yeah, just give us any feedback we can use that will help us uh, make the Thanksgiving event better. And then last no, uh, the last one is just you can enter, your, you can put your username here for the chance to win a bond. And then if you have any other information, this is a you know just a comment box. You can put whatever you want here. So that is it for the survey. Um, if you have anything to add on that, we're thinking about adding gambling. Um, please fill out that survey. It's going to help us figure out what you know what we need to work on and what, what we need to focus on. Uh, I've got a couple more invention things to show. I don't remember exactly what I showed. I know I showed augmenting, but I don't know if I showed the experience. We haven't. Uh, finish the experience rates. I'm still working on it. As you can see, I'm actually working on like the costs and whatnot. If you want, well, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just. If you want, if you really want to pause, if you want to be a tryhard and like figure out what items you need to stock up on, you can pause and find out. But uh, the skill is here. This is what it looked like. People were wondering. This was actually in game. We put it in game a while back. Once we, once we had it, and it, it kind of caused some confusion. People thought that they, uh, that it was released, and people, you know, had 99 and it whatnot because it wasn't correctly coded yet. Uh, so we removed it. So some people have already seen it, but this is what it'll look like. It does correspond to your total level. Let me peer in a couple rat crabs real quick. The actual XP rates and whatnot are not coded yet. These are just the, the, the rates he set for testing and whatnot. And then they don't have stats or animations. As you can see, I'm kicking with it and whatnot. So I'm still focusing on that. I'll have to redo the IDs, but that's uh, that's my, my problem on my end. So uh, yeah, if we uh, take off this thing and we use one of these siphons on it. I like how they're... Stackable, but not really. <laughs> um, hold on, I, I think I have to, I think I have to restart. Right, so I guess siphoning isn't working yet correctly, but you can um, disassemble. This, this disassembling removes the item, so you, you ideally you'd want to siphon. But disassembling uh, gives you a full experience, and then siphoning would give you half. So if I was to siphon it, just half this number. Uh, let me get rid of that. Should level up. As you see, it does show the little thing there, and uh, now we're 76 invention, and it does affect your total level, so uh, that's working out pretty cool. I believe Dark is working on a skill keep as well. I don't have anything to show for that yet, but once that is out, I'll either show it or we'll just wait till somebody gets 99 and, and let them get it, I guess. But uh, yeah, I think that's it for this video. Um, still working on invention. Should be good to go before the 10th. going to be grinding out these last couple days. Um, I know I haven't been on the server much, and I know that that always hurts the player count whenever I'm not on, whenever I can't be on, but 
I'm trying, and once invention is done, we'll have a little bit more free time. I can, you know, I can focus on, you know, talking with you guys and being the owner rather than the developer. So that should be fun. Also, if you haven't heard, John is making YouTube videos again, so go check out his channel. I'll have his link in the description below as well. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.